crazy looking back on the five years here. I remember like distinctively looking at Nicole one weekend we were in our third year and I said, wow, we're getting old and fast. Like it's, it's catching up fast and look at where we are today. So <laughs> yeah, getting slapped in the face by Caitlin is, it's an honor, honestly. <laughs> That's when you know you've done something great, yeah. You'll think that a ball's gonna hit the floor and then she just comes out of nowhere. And she's always like makes mid-air digs where her entire body's off the ground and she's still able to put it up in like a perfect spot. And yeah, like the condition I've seen her elbow in a lot of times, even when she got injured over the weekend, she like was in pain on the floor and still put her body to the wayside to make a couple digs and save the play. And it's, yeah, it's just amazing. The girls give me so much energy and I love playing volleyball so, so much. It's going to be hard to see myself stepping away from Brandon University and not wearing the blue and gold, but it's just the, the girls around me and, and I love playing with them so much and I have so much passion for this sport. She's always there, like off the court to talk if you need to talk to someone and just even as like, like in school, she's such a good role model that she's like going into like med school, amazing, smart lady, and she's also just performing insanely, like perfect on the court. I think I definitely see my legacy playing into the girls that are coming up after, you know, this huge graduating class here. We have Danny, we have Avery, Keeley, all these youngsters that have so much potential, and I think their work, their work ethic I think is something that something that I've helped trailblaze hopefully with the graduating class and um, so yeah definitely the work ethic and the team culture.